Hi, and welcome to Logical Steps podcast. Now today I'm going to show you how to fit a graphics card. But before you buy a new graphics card, there are a few things you need to check. Now the first thing you need to check is what type of slot your computer has. Now there are three types of slots. There's your PCI X, your PCI Express, and your AGP. But the only real way of making certain you've got the right type of graphic card is to check the manual. So read the specification and then you're ready to go. Next you're going to need to check which type of connector you want to use. Now there are two types of connectors. There's your DVI which is digital and that's relevant to your TFT monitors. And you've also got your VGA which is a backward compatible monitor connector um, and that's relevant to your CRT. So, once you've decided that, you finally need to decide which brand you're going to go for. Now, presently in the market, there are two market leaders. You've got your NVIDIA and you've got your um, ATI. Now, the difference between them is much to much. So, what you need to do at the time that you're going to buy is check which one has made the advances and go with your feeling. But once you've decided on that, you're ready to go. Now, before you take your graphics card out or touch your graphics card, you're going to need to earth yourself. So what you can do, if you haven't got an anti-static wristband, is to touch your computer. Right. Touch my computer. Now, there would normally be screws in, but I've taken those out. And then you just slide your top off. Ooh, that was easy. Just earth myself again. Um, now, to fit a graphics card, I've always found it easier to line up your graphics card with the end knot and also fit it in angle. So, once you've got it in the right place, push it in and you should hear a click like that. And that means this thing. Oops. In. <laughs> was a bit tricky. Then you can place your slot. Now there are a couple more things you need to consider when buying a graphics card. You need to consider the memory. Now an awful lot of people do go on about memory. And yes, memory size is important. But what's really important is your GPU. Now your GPU is very similar to your CPU. It's your graphic processing speed. And if you're going for a gaming box and you want that extra edge, then a high GPU, a fast GPU, will improve your performance and your graphics rendering. So, that's in, graphics on. All you'll need to do now is put your connectors in and you're ready to go. So, thanks for coming to see Logical Steps, a podcast, and hopefully I'll see you soon. But bye for now.